All right, so this video is all about the grades and the settings within Smarter Contact. So as your conversations come in, you're going to get many responses. You're going to get people responding that they're interested, that they're not interested, maybe later, um, follow-up prospects. You're going to get a whole different array of responses. And it's very important to use Smarter Contact not only to prospect, but to use it as a CRM, which it is. So as the leads come in, um, you really want to spend some time grading them individually. So, for example, this customer here um, says, "Hey, you have the wrong, you have the right person." So, okay, great. So we know it's the right person, and you can qualify this lead. I would, in this example, take a little bit more time to qualify this person. This person's using it for real estate, but it doesn't matter what industry you're using it for. Um, and maybe they respond positively, they're interested. So we know we have the right person's number and you can grade it as correct number or follow up later. Um, and in here in the grading function, you can go through and add as many as you want. So this person added a whole bunch of different grades, not interested, wrong number, follow up later, new lead. There's no uh, restriction on how much uh, you can do with grades. And here you can create your own, you can edit the grade settings simply by going here and create your own custom grade and as many as you'd like. Um, and this just really helps you to keep track of your data. It keeps helps you keep track. So think about the kind of leads that you're getting. And I want you to ask a couple, couple important questions. What are the most common responses that you're getting from customers, right? So if you watch the macros, um, training before, I really recommend watching that as well. But ask yourself, when you're creating grades, what are the most buckets of your customers? Follow-up bucket, right? Um, very interested, like hot bucket, cold bucket, warm bucket, like nurture bucket. You know, there's a whole bunch of different classifications, and I'm just giving you some examples. So think about how many buckets you need, how many grades you need. This person really took it to the next level. They did probably about 10 of them. But at least at a bare minimum, five of them uh, would be really helpful and you can name them any way you want. And then what's also great is you can send them each a custom campaign. So here I can export them, right? And once I export them, I can actually send them right back to a brand new Smarter Contact campaign. So think about that, guys. Uh, really effective tool. Highly recommend you use the grade feature. It's really going to help you classify your leads and then sort, you know, here I can sort by all my hot leads, boom, they're right there and I know who to follow up with. So the next week when you're following up with your leads, you go through all your hot leads and you know right there who you should be calling and uh, spending even more time on. So hopefully that was helpful guys.